Sorin Valley, three hours past first light. This is a bad idea, Clavius. Man, if the captain finds out about this... I know, I know. We'll catch up with the rest of the unit later. If we hurry, they won't even notice we're gone. Trust me, this is important. But why? You still haven't told me who this so-called friend of yours is. What makes you so sure he can help us? He was a soldier, Jaren. Maybe the best. He taught me everything I know. If anyone can help us, it's him. Look, you wait here. He's not too keen on having visitors. It'll be easier if I go alone. Whatever. Just make it quick. Hello? Are you here, sir? It's important! It's too early in the morning for important matters, Clavius. You're on the Royal Guard now. You don't have time to be my nursemaid anymore. As you can see, I'm taking great care of myself. I'm glad to see that you're doing so well. But that's not why I came. It's about Aramis. There was an incident at his home last night. We don't have all the details, but it's been confirmed that an entire squad of our men was slaughtered, along with a female civilian. Damn. Any leads? None. And it gets worse. Aramis's daughter was never found. We believe that she may have been abducted. Or worse. I know you and Aramis were close. That's why I came, sir. You are not powerless in this. Right back with me. Help us find the ones responsible and bring them to justice. <laughs> Sir? I'm sorry. I can't help you. Please go. Sir, wait! Go, Clavius. And never come back. You heard the drunk. Let's get out of here. Hmph. <laughs> Some friend. Jaren. Whoa, what a dump. Jaren, please! This house was to be a gift for his wife on their wedding day. But there isn't the slightest trace of a woman living here. What'd she do? Leave him? No. She never got to see the house. She was killed on their wedding day. After that, he saw no reason to finish it. Would you? You said he was a soldier. Yes, Garrison. Perhaps the greatest swordsman that ever lived. Garrison? You're telling me that guy was THE Garrison? Whoa, I thought he was dead. In many ways, Jaren, he is. Miles away, at Newland's secluded cottage. Yes? Calibretto, listen. I'm headed to the marketplace to see if I can get some food and a change of clothes if I were a guest. Need anything while I'm out? Gears? Bolts? No, thank you. However, we are running low on birdseed. <laughs> you and your little strays. Is the child still asleep? Quite peacefully. Good. Hell of a rough night that kid had. Now listen up. Those gloves ain't some sentimental heirloom left by dear old dad. They're extremely dangerous. Don't let her near them until I get back. If I'd known they were in that damn box, I never would have opened it. A child, you have many questions. What shall I say? Nothing. We'll let King Veneer handle this. If this attack had any connection to Aramis's disappearance, then he needs to know. Just remember. Until I get back, no gloves! Got it? Understood. Nolan, did you forget something? Calibretto? Side with him. Hurry. Only stunned is he. Heavy he is. Parts. <laughs> Good parts. Expensive parts. <laughs> you didn't really think you'd escape from me, did you? 
I was foolish in talking with you. It cost me dearly. I won't be so nice this time around. Spread out. She's here. Where, child? Where's your Orion savior now? Hmm? Look at this. The daughter of Aramis. Too scared to even move. I hate killing prey that won't run. I'm not running from you anymore, ever. Oh. What we missed. Nothing worth dying for. <laughs> The child's screams came from the forest. What could have caused such destruction? Tell me! Tell me why you've done this to my father! Tell me! Enough. He can no longer give you the answers which you seek. I didn't mean to. I, I swear, I didn't mean to do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Calibretto. I'm so sorry. The Mono Region. <laughs> this is wonderful news! Simply wonderful! Ah, so you finally decided to retire, leaving the bulk of your considerable wealth to your most trusted, most honored, most humble manservant. No! Even better! It's been confirmed! Our little dwarven friends to the south have located a new meta pool! One of the largest yet! Oh, how exciting! Were I not carrying your lunch, I might have broken into a dance. Just set it down! I must inform Vanier of the great news! Oh, I almost forgot. This parcel arrived for you early this morning. There is a note attached, but no one seems to know who sent it. Thank you. Oh, and Philbin, do not make light of our current situation. Mana continues to grow more and more scarce. Without mana to power it, all of our technology would be crippled. So you see, he who holds the mana holds the power, and power is everything. Remember that. I am constantly aware of that fact, sir. Enjoy your meal. Yes, but first... A bit of mana, if you will. Your wildest dreams I shall fulfill. Oh. Intrigue! I love it. Let's see, then. Oh, exquisite. Still playing with dolls, Raymond. <laughs> that voice. No, it can't be! We buried you! <laughs> Possessed of a power far greater than you might ever imagine. And power, my fleshy friend, is everything! That bloated thief was only the first to fall. They will all pie for their own betrayal, each in their own special way. But you, old man, you I'm saving for last. I want to be there to see the look on your face. What the? My house. What happened to my house? Please, try to stay calm. The gloves, they... Gloves? The gloves? I will explain, but you must calm down. Your temper tantrum is affecting the environment. It's about to affect something else if you don't start talking and fast. The lesser return only this time around along a band of grinners who managed to incapacitate me momentarily using some sort of magnetic pulse cannon. Okay. I slipped the child to fend for herself. Only she used the gloves. Okay. I proceeded to destroy their entire numbers as well as the house. Okay. Where is she? She's in what's left of the sunroom. 
Are you going to ask us to leave? No. I'm going to ask you to stay. This is your home now, for as long as you'd like it to be. Thanks, Master Nolan. Not a problem. Just make sure you get plenty of rest. You have one heck of a mess to clean up in the morning. Elsewhere. Is everything ready? Yes, your holiness. All according to plan. Well then, you'd better hold on to something. Because this is where things get ugly. To be continued. <laughs>